Hey there, my name is Kathy. Welcome to the Junk Shack, baby. Today's video is just a quickie. I am putting this video together at 6.30 on Tuesday evening, and I normally upload by 7 a.m. on Wednesday. Uh, we'll see how this goes. Um, a couple weeks, maybe even a couple months back, my girlfriend, she had a big sale, and I went and helped her out, and I posted a video, and it was called The Best Sale Ever. Well, anyway, she calls me over the weekend and says, I'm ready to do it again. I said, cool beans, I'm in. Only this time, I'm bringing some stuff to sell too. Just want to kind of show off some of the things I'll be taking to the sale. It's this Friday and Saturday. It's going to be a little bit of a problem for me to sell some of this stuff. The problem is I want a little bit of money. I know what I got. So they're not going to be priced for garage sale prices. So I'm going to make a little bit of money but probably not as much as I could or would if I were to put them online on eBay or I don't know, even on Marketplace, but then I gotta deal with people. I don't wanna do that. This is just a little bitty, tiny little part of what I'm gonna take to her house. Um, I will video it as I put it all out and hopefully it'll look cute. I'm gonna try to make it look store-like. That's why it's important to make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss this Sunday's video. I have a bunch of linens. Really, really nice blanket. Couple rugs, shower curtains, some curtains, some more curtains, and some shears. I have a couple of bags of clothes that I just hadn't donated yet. I've got these, which I've had for a little while. I absolutely love them and had a million plans with them. I have another one hanging on the wall. They all three have a light in them and I wanted to do something really cool with them. But I had only put the one up and I still have these two. I'm thinking about taking them to the sale. I didn't pay a whole lot for them, but I think I'd probably want maybe $20 each for them. I have this extra cool this lamp is as tall as I am, and the top is even taller than me. But this is a really cool candlestick brass lamp. Probably didn't pay over $10 for it. And I would probably want, probably $30, if not maybe $40, I don't know. It's so hard! So here I am, and I'm not doing anything with it. It's taking up wall space and drawer space, and space i need to get rid of it i painted this table which turned out absolutely gorgeous and if i don't get my money for it i will be bringing it home but i did make a video so you won't miss that then i painted this table which is disappointing I didn't pay a lot for it, but all those little knobs, oh my goodness, I'd be here for a year sanding those. I gave up. It's not worth it. I'm gonna let this go for probably five bucks. I don't know, maybe 10, because I bought it for five and put a whole can of spray paint on it. Alrighty, I pulled a bunch of this stuff out of the bar. I've had these for a really long time, well, maybe 15 years, and they say bourbon, gin, scotch, and vodka. And I always had them in my bar. I've always loved them, but it's time to move them on. This old butter dish is just gigantic. It says Mikasa, who knows? That's pretty cool, this little red shaker. I've got a couple of different barware things. You know, not worth a bunch of money, but taking up space in my bar and we never use it. Picked this up for a quarter. It looks like a beer bottle. Well, it was, a, it is a beer bottle, but it's shaped like a baseball bat. Some kind of addition. It was a quarter. <laughs> I'm gonna probably put a buck or two on it. Some silver, uh, silver plated candlesticks. And then this, this is pretty cool. I don't know, I'll probably want to get a couple of dollars for it. It's got a nice good cork on it. I think it's kind of old. I don't think it's antique or anything. 
but I probably put it up for it. I probably need at least four or five bucks for it. It says liquor bottle. <laughs> Duh. I got this pretty blue dish. It's big and it's heavy. And it does have a little sticker on it. It took me a long time to figure that out. And finally, it says dishwasher safe. <laughs> so this is not old, I don't think. But it's super nice and super heavy and super beautiful. It's really hard for me to sell this because it goes with my icy blue and white Christmas theme so well. And I always have silver balls spilling out of it with some silver beads. Merry Christmas, everyone. I think I'm going to need probably 10 or $12 for this blue one. I don't know. We'll see. I haven't researched it in a long time. I might need to see if it's anything. And then my haker. This is a favorite piece. And it might not even go out for sale. I really love the colors. I love the shape. I just, that mid-century. Oh, it just screams to my heart to love me and take me home. So I don't know. I don't know. Man, it takes up a lot of space in the little bit of cabinet space I have. I might put 40 on it. I don't know. I might not sell it at all. Maybe I'll put 100. Ha! I don't expect to get 100 ever, but... Uh, my last video, I showed you these, and a lovely viewer commented and told me they are Onyx stemware, and I looked them up, and they're not worth a whole pile of money, but they're worth a whole lot more money than I paid for them. So, I don't know. I'll probably take them, probably put... One of them's got a big chip on them. I don't know. I'd probably be happy to get 15-ish bucks for all three of them. I think that'd be fair. I painted up a bunch of silver trays. Um, I got them for nothing. They're cheap. It's no big deal if nothing ever happens with them. But I'm going to put maybe a stencil, maybe a sticker. I don't know. Maybe some words, something. I have five of them. I'm going to do a little something special. See if I can't maybe get five bucks a tray for them. If they say real something really cool or they look really cool, it shouldn't be a problem. I really am sorry that I don't have my typical video for Wednesday for today. I'm unprepared. I have too many things going on to concentrate on one. I've been painting a bunch of different stuff. So I do have some videos coming up with all that stuff in it. But I found myself with no inspiration and nothing to film this morning. Here it is Tuesday evening. And I'm just throwing this together to give you something to look at and to look forward to. Don't forget to look for the video on the sale coming this Sunday. Really, really cool stuff. I am putting this video together at 6.30. At 6.30. In person. Thanks a bunch for watching. See you guys next week. Same time, same place. Junk Shack, baby.